Hey everyone, welcome back to my garden and I wanted to show you quickly my little grow space so you could see what's currently going on and you get a nice little idea of what's to come. So we basically have on the left over here, these are my two new cucumber plants. These are dragon egg cucumbers and it's going to put on these beautiful little yellowish little little cukes that's about the size of a basically like a large a large egg about maybe three inches and down here we got some beautiful little peppers that i topped earlier let me actually bring you in closer you could begin to see just how nice the stem is beginning to thicken up in just only like a matter of about a week or so and look at all this new leaf growth that's, that came on. Things are doing really nicely. And right over here, these are little mini bell peppers actually. And back here, look at the orange plants doing excellent. It has a lot of new leaves. And it just keeps on doing well. And let me actually pull it out so I could show you what the root system looks like. It's really interesting. Not like the other plants, it's more of like almost like little branches and that looks real nice and you can see it's a nice yellow color so I think it's, that looks really healthy and that's being grown in a little hydroponic Kratky system so if anybody wants to grow a little orange plant you definitely can grow the hydroponic and back there we got some summer savory and some dough that's doing nicely and we have a couple of orange little orange pepper plants. I got about six of them, seven of them growing and the little wildflower beds doing really nice. It has a lot of new leaf growth and hopefully I can't wait for this thing to put on some little flowers and I think it's gonna smell amazing indoors and I basically just water this thing with the same hydroponic fertilizer that I do all my other plants and as you see it's not in a hydroponic system it's just in a little container filled with cocoa core and I just water this thing when it when as it needs so that's grown nice and well and up here we have a lot of new plants we have all these beautiful lettuce plants that are beginning to get nice and big they were really small a few days ago and we have some sage and some borage and some thyme and some, I believe some summer savory and also what I'm most excited about let me bring you a little bit down here you could really see it is right over here these three little beautiful little guys right here are my ground cherries actually and what I'm gonna do is basically now that they sprouted I'm gonna wait till tomorrow so they get a little bit bigger and I'm gonna spread these out and split them up basically give each one its own home and I'll probably keep two of them and maybe give the other one to a friend but for now I'm super excited for the, that the ground cherries have sprouted and this is basically day one of the ground cherries so that's doing really well you want to keep that really close to the light as soon as they sprout up make sure you put it underneath the light system and I just put it in between the, the tops of the cups here so it's about one inch away from the lights and that's doing really excellent and over here this is my uh, what is this this is the bean plant and this is actually a stringless bean plant so it's not gonna be growing up the vine it's basically going to be a bush bean so nice and compact and it'll grow a ton of beans and back here we have the rat's tail radish plant yeah, let's do a look at that i got three in one that's doing nicely here are the 18 day radishes today's already day 20 and they're still not ready and we got some swiss chard back here Thanks for watching.